In this tutorial, you will learn about DKI or dynamic keyword insertion. And of course, what are the benefits of using DKI and more importantly, how to apply DKI for your Google Ads campaign. Hey everyone, Carlos Obado here and I'm a digital marketing expert who specializes in lead generation and I also teach about Facebook ads, Google ads, and SEO. And so, if that's something that you are into, then consider subscribing. Alright, so DKI stands for Dynamic Keyword Insertion. It is a function or a feature that is available if you are using Google Ads. And what that feature does is it will show the keyword that triggered the search and automatically add that keyword within the ad copy. So if we look at this account right here, we are right within this ad group. And within this ad group, I have one, two, three, four, five keywords. So any of these keywords can trigger one of my ads. So if Manulife Insurance trigger the ad, this term right here will be included within my ad copy. And it's my preference to add DKI within, let's say, headline one or headline two, or even within the description. Now, if this one, this keyword trigger the ad, then it will be automatically added in my ad copy. And if this keyword manual life term life insurance trigger the ad then it will be seen by the searcher within the ad copy and so on and so forth now what are the benefits of using DKI Number one is, of course, you will have a better click-through rate since you will be adding the exact term that triggered the ad to your ad copies that will be more relevant to the searcher, which in return will give you a better ad relevance and also a higher click-through rate. And of course, if you have those two, ultimately you will have higher quality scores. And as we all know, if you have higher quality scores, you will have cheaper CPC or cost per click and of course, cheaper cost per conversion and better return on ad spend. And another benefit of using DKI is especially if you have hundreds of keywords or a lot of keywords just like in these campaigns, it's not ideal to use CAGs to boost up your quality score. So in that case scenario, your only option is to use DKI, which is also, it yields good results and it will give you better chance of, high, of getting higher quality score. All right, so how do we apply DKI to our Google Ads campaign? Just go to the ad creation or edit your ad and then select which part of the ad would you like the DKI to appear. That can be in H1, H2, or H3, or it can also appear within your description. So in this example, I will be going for H1. So all you have to do is type a curly bracket in there and a drop down option will appear. So let's go ahead and click keyword insertion and it will ask for a default text. That only means that when none of your keywords within your ad group triggers the ad, then this default text will be included in your ad copy. So let's go ahead and type my preferred or my default text. And since it will be within H1, I'm going to make it a title case. 
hit apply and then save the ad now another tip that I can add to this when we go to the landing page as you can see we already have a default text in here now how do I make this this headline dynamic of course to match your ad and to have a better landing page experience because uh, if they search for let's say manual life life insurance code code is not in here manual life life insurance code is not within this uh within, the, within this ad copy so the solution for that is by using a plugin if you're using wordpress you can use this plugin that i'm using and it's called convertaholic so it will match the search term or the keywords that trigger the ad and also add that as the header of the landing page so of course that will also contribute to your quality score so that's how you use DKI within Google Ads and also for your landing page which is in my opinion is equally important because they can search for manual life life insurance and then get here and then they might see manual life let's say dental dental plans which is a totally different thing if you find this video helpful please smash that like button and if you have any questions or suggestions feel free to comment them below and i will reply to each and every one of them